Now that you've already typed in the interpretation, I'm gonna walk us through the two predictions and we're going to use that equation for both of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and jot that down again below my good sentence. Y equals 0.15X plus 1995, okay? And now we are going to go read the problem and we're going to see, did they give us an X or Y idea to plug in? And we're gonna use our original labels up here. So, how many miles did Oscar drive if his total car rental bill was $24.45? So we're gonna go and ask, is that number the problem gave us an X idea or a Y idea? $24.95. $24.95, that sounds to me like the total cost to rent. $24.95 is not miles traveled. They gave us a dollar amount, which goes with costs, not miles. So in this problem, the total bill of $24.45 was the total cost. So we're gonna go replace that with the Y down here. Instead of Y, we're gonna put that cost from the problem. And now I want to see if we remember to solve. In order to solve for x, we need to get rid of the close number and the far away number. We're going to get rid of the far away number to start, always using our op opposites. So the opposite of adding 1995 is subtracting 1995 from both sides. So we'll end up having 0.15x over here. And then I will need to go and do that subtraction. If you need, there is a Desmos calculator available to you that I will make sure there is a good link. So 24.45 minus that starting cost of the 19.95 gives us 4.5, 4.5. And to get rid of that close attached number at the end, that is multiplication. So the opposite is dividing both sides by 0.15. And 4.5 divided by 0.15. I'll now go over here. Oops. So we will take that 4.5 divided by 0.15. And we end up getting 30 there. So the answer was 30. They drove 30 miles if they were charged 24.45. Now we're gonna go do that other one while we're still here. So how much will it cost to rent a car if you drove 31 miles? So we're gonna take the number the problem gave us, decide if it was an X or a Y idea, and then plug it in. So before I even get started, I'm just gonna write down that e box off my other problem and jot down the same equation again. And now, let's see. How much will it cost to rent for 31 miles? 31 is not a cost. 31 in this prob problem was miles, which went with X. So now I'm going to go and delete X down there and replace, the, replace it with the 31. We are going to use nice parentheses to organize our math. And now we can see this is just a little PEMDAS problem. We just need to multiply here, then add the 1995. So I'm gonna go do the 0.15 times 31. 0.15 times 31. I'm gonna hit enter. And that gets the 4.65. And now I just need to add in that 1995 there at the end. So the 4.65 now plus the 19.95 and that would have charged them $24.06. And these would be the two problems you go type into the Nearpod.